We'll now move on to brief demonstration part of new Uniface 9 functionality. Please note the following demonstrations will not go into great depth of the new functionality, as that will be covered in later spotlights. Here is the familiar Uniface development environment. As you can see, UDE has gone through a facelift with new, more modern look and feel. As mentioned during our presentation, we are now using Grid Widget inside the development environment. So let's take a look at some of the benefits this brings to the developer. Here's the open form component screen from where you can select existing components for editing. In the past, the list of components was built using repeated occurrences, which had a fixed size and format, so that resizing the screen would have no effect on the number of records shown. Now, by using the grid widget, we can resize this component, for instance, and see a large number of records. Another useful enhancement within the Uniface development environment is the new diagram editor we introduced. The diagram editor enables you to create and view diagrams of your application model and edit the model objects displayed in the diagram. You can create multiple diagrams for each model and display supertype and subtype entities, component subtypes, one-to-many relationships, as well as inheritance relationships in each diagram. You can specify which entities you want to display in each diagram and whether to display fields, keys and relationships. For example, the following diagram shows the entities and their one-to-many relationships with each other. It also shows functional subtypes and the inheritance relationships within the employee supertype entity. The overview box shows the complete diagram with the rectangle around the part that is visible to the viewer. You can move this rectangle to navigate around the diagram, which is particularly useful for large diagrams with many entities. You can also use the diagram editor to move and resize selected entity boxes, or completely delete them from the diagram. You can insert segment handles on the relationship lines to reroute them to your liking. You can navigate to specific entities or relationships and edit the properties, fields, keys or relationships. For example, select an entity and click fields to edit the entity fields. You can edit the properties of specific fields, keys or data relationship by double clicking on the field, key icon relationship respectively. Here you'll notice I'm clicking on a key and define key component is shown. Now by selecting a relationship and double clicking on the relationship, define relationship component is shown. Once created, diagrams can be printed or exported to a variety of formats such as BMP, JPEG, GIF, PNG, TIFF and meta files. This is an extremely useful feature that enables you to incorporate diagrams in design documentation or presentations. This concludes our UDE and Diagram Editor demonstration.